Welcome everyone, it's the Black Rainbow. I hope you're doing amazing. So let's dive into your reading. Um, thank you for stopping by, I really appreciate that. Thank you for your lovely comments and your encouragement for me to do a, a course. I am still, I've still not uh, said, put the send button, but I think I'll do that. <laughs> I, I'm going to do this uh, advanced tarot course, just so I do my typical me. I uh, bite of more than I can chew. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I, I hope all of you are doing amazing. It's getting colder here. Uh, yes, yeah, so autumn just suddenly landed with a bang. Um, anyway, uh, please like, subscribe. I'm using, or leave a comment as well. Thank you so much for your lovely comments. Comments. I'm using the Rider Waite tarot deck. It's a giant deck. Uh, I just seen the magician fly on the floor. <laughs> so I'm going to look into the person that is showing up in your energy and I'm going to look into their feelings and their intentions and actions towards you and uh, what are your feelings and intentions? What is the most likely outcome as well and what else I can also find that is standing out in your energy? All right. I'm picking up celebration coming towards you. Uh, definitely celebration. Uh, this is your time to shine. I'm getting. All right. Yes, this card here wants to. Someone wants to celebrate with you or you are going to meet someone when you're celebrating. Wow, the nine of uh, pentacles. You feel that you are, you are someone that have the skills to do you know, to do what you want, but also to get wealthy of your skills. And perhaps you are, there's a breakthrough that, that is happening here. We have the four of cups in reverse. So if you doubted that there will be love coming into your life, or if you even lost your interest in love, well, someone is here to show you otherwise the king of pentacles. They could have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in their chart. Intuitively, you might have been picking up on this person's feelings, you might even know them, or you pick up that there is something between you and them. Now, you might not have seen this person for a while, I feel this person, uh, there are definitely, there is a person here that, well, they left someone they love and that person is you. You could have Pisces, Scorpio in your chart, and they could have tried to send you messages and they have been returned to sender. Maybe they are blocked. They are trying to find you. Maybe they can't find you. So this person is going to have to, if they are secretly watching you, they're going to have to say, hi, I am, I've been secretly watching you for a while, but I can't really watch you secretly because I can't find you. So I'm going to have to come and find you, <laughs> knock on your door or have to go about something in a way that they were very scared to to do that um and i'm going to pick this card up so uh, we have the the magician okay you're feeling creative you're sharpening your tools you are you're onto something here collective you're onto something that is going to be very rewarding for you maybe you have to do something out of your comfort zone or you have to just you have to follow your intuition, but also you have to follow something by the book. It could be a little bit tricky, actually. You are in between two worlds. It's a, it's a tricky energy. It's that you're watching someone do something like the hard way, but because you've done it before, you are just saying, nah, okay, I'm going to watch, I'm going to watch people quarrel, but I, I'm not going to. I'm not gonna go down that route, okay? I, I know that is not necessary. Um, so there is something you are doing um, that is different than what other people could be doing. You could be getting some looks saying like, what are you doing? You are arrogant, aloof. Are you not gonna, are you not gonna get involved? It's almost like there is an ele election. I don't know anything about politics, so like, let's not go down that lane. So, the, it, well, let's say if there's an election and you were to say like, I'm not interested in it. And then you, then you get like, what? What do you mean? If you're saying that at the wrong place, I'm pretty sure that's what you will get. So, so there, this could be some somewhere you are. Maybe you are somewhere where you are supposed to be very interested and engaged, and then you are like, you are, you have been interested and engaged, but you have already made your choice. You made your decision. You have wisdom. You don't really need to participate in that. But there will be a crowd there. It's just like, why are you not getting involved? Why are you so distant? 
something like that is happening around you. Now, when we are looking up at this person here, they could have Pisces, uh, Sagittarius in their chart. This person, I, mm, I see that this person is thinking how to, to work on this connection, all right? How can they express their romantic feelings? Can they express their romantic feelings? Because they don't even know where you are, how are they gonna reach you? Um, strong like Taurus in this reading. Uh, yeah, very strong Taurus. What is happening in this person's... Okay, so... What is happening in this person's environment? They're nervous, so they find it hard to be patient. They're finding it hard to stay calm, but they they are doing it anyway. They have to. Mm, yes, there is some daggers around them. It's that kind of, in their environment, they can't really say to anyone that they have feelings for you. They can't even make, say that they like you. This seems very sort of spying on you, but they can't tell you that yet, at least. So there's a bit of that. But anyway, this person is definitely coming towards you. That's for sure. But when they do come towards you, that could be a Scorpio. If you are not a Scorpio, could be a third party or someone around them can be, you know, friend. Uh, I'm getting a mother or I'm getting, I'm getting a friend, perhaps. Someone, it could be also um, an ex. This could be a, if, if someone could be born on the cusp of Scorpio or Sagittarius. Or, or someone could have Pisces in their chart. Someone could have be Sagittarius with Pisces in their chart. They are, yeah, because this person, okay, this person's very stressed. Very stressed, and they know they are losing out on their wish fulfillment. Now, this person's very stressed. Um, they're afraid to speak their mind. They're afraid to... Yeah, this, this is someone that's showing up in your energy that has fear. They are going through a very difficult time. Could be a custody battle. They're going through something with uh, yeah someone here. I feel that strongly, yeah. There is a tower moment with a Scorpio or with someone. This is all, yeah, something is happening uh, with a person. If you, if you know someone that is dealing with a Scorpio, Pisces, uh, you're dealing with a, oh, this person could be Sagittarius. There's a Pi there's Pisces coming up. Pisces is coming up several times. So you could be Pisces or they could be Taurus. I feel they could have Taurus in their chart. They know they will come your way. But someone is, there is a, yeah, th their intentions is to kind of get through this. A tower. There's a lot of, there is a lot of noise to, there's been a lot of uh, obstacles for this person to come your way there's like a there is like no definitely cannot go go that way but in their feelings they want to you are their wish fulfillment but they could be trying to talk themselves out of it because someone is causing a lot of trouble for it someone here they are dealing with it could be an ex if you're uh, someone is definitely young and there is someone that's very 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 stressed wow very stressed about you very stressed about them, them coming towards you they're stressed that they have feelings about you but they're not saying it oh my god okay so uh we're going to continue and clarify um moving on okay if i can find thanks okay so the hierophant we have the um, there's a lot of like arguing i'm getting just people like up in someone's business, wanting to know everything, you know, very nosy and this kind of stuff. Okay, then as a person that is coming out of you know, being a secret admirer to being the one, someone that is uh, very, there is someone, that, someone has been with someone very like immature, like they could be moving away from someone that is like 10 years, this is a Leo, 10 years younger than you or something like that. Oh my God. So we have the Hierophant and the Devil. Here we have jealousy, obsessive. Someone is attached to social and marital, marital status. And we have the Tower, my goodness. 
okay, there is definitely a family situation that is going up in flames because some and someone is coming your way. Oh my god, there is so much argument. There is that, yeah, there's there's a lot of argument. This person is single, they're coming towards you, but they could know you from, from the past as well. Wow, what is why is the devil here with the hierophant? Hierophant? Why is the devil here? Oh, this came out. Oh my god, so someone don't care. Someone don't care. Someone don't care. Oh my god, I'm getting like this particular someone is there saying, I don't know why I listen to you, like I don't care, you are a crazy witch. <laughs> I'm kidding. Someone is just, yeah, and I'm getting this high priestess. So a person that's married, was married, is married, they're coming in. This is someone you have feelings for, they have feelings for you, but they're going to like press the doorbell, they're going to tell you that there is feelings between the two of you. That's unexpressed as well. And they don't care what anyone says. They're coming your way. They're leaving someone. Yeah, my God. And sending a message to you. Leaving someone that is literally stalking them. That's what I'm seeing. My gosh. Yeah, pretty much. You, uh, your intentions is to, okay, find out what, what this is about. You intuitively feel that they're coming towards you. You could be sort of trying to avoid them a little bit. You're staying very secretive about it. You haven't told anyone about your feelings for this person, for many of you. Um, you could be learning something. You could be, you know, in this, uh, you know, this could be a student, teacher dynamic as well. You could be the teacher if there's a twin flame union. We have the four of one, so you are the teacher. Maybe they are the student here. Uh, Someone that they have been with that is not the true Queen of Cups to them. Uh, someone here that has been kind of nuts. They are getting away from this situation. They were always going to come back towards you. But I'm getting here, there is someone that knows that they are coming towards you. They know, yeah, they know they are coming your way. Why is the... But there is nothing no one can do. There's a lot of passion between the two of you from... From the get-go. Nine of Swords. You're getting your happiness. It's very exciting. But someone on a distance, they will give you some grief because you are happy. Uh, with the with the Empress, someone, yeah, they will someone will watch you flourish, someone will watch you travel, someone will watch you get a lot of money here. So there could be people like this, uh, what I'm getting here is jealousy around you. That's it. Jealousy for sure. This could be from a, a Pisces um, or a Gemini. Um, basically, or Pis Pisces again, I'm getting... Okay, someone is very jealous that they eventually are coming your way and that they are going to tell you the truth. They are they're going to tell you how they feel. They are going to tell you they love you. They're going to tell you that unfortunately they have been stuck with someone that is bad, cheap, crazy. And uh, they are, <laughs> it's just, see, because they're showing up here as the king of pentacles. So they're going to tell you that they were dealing with a narcissistic person, crazy person. This is, could be someone that threatens with all kinds of stuff, throwing plates, dishes, uh, throwing themselves. Someone that very, very crazy. Someone that could have some, men like some mental problems, like as in mental, like so someone here yeah, that drinks uh, a lot or like something, someone mixes stuff with something and like can uh, get like over emotional and just be a, be like thinking that that's just how they're going to be to the end of days because that's the only way they can get someone to stay. Yeah, this person as well. Okay, this person here has a reputation for being a player. They could be in a relationship with someone for a very, very long time. They have a reputation of being a player. I'm getting that again. But with you, well, they're showing up as the king of pentacles. But they are, have been juggling. 
they are juggling, they are one foot in the door, one foot out the door with a third party. This person is young. They could have married too young. This person here will send you a message. This person here does miss you. This person here has quite a lot of baggage. They could have Taurus or Aries in their chart. Now, I also see here, um, you could have dealing with the Gemini. You and this person are meant to get together for sure. Um, yeah. There could be Libra around you as well. Gem I get a Libra, Gemini. Hmm. Okay, let's continue. So, let's continue here. What is going on with the situation here, spirits? Okay, we have the Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here? Why is the Nine of Swords? Okay, this fell out. So, someone is trying to block this connection like a hidden enemy. Why is the hidden enemy here? Yeah, why is the Nine of Swords? Someone has a depression. Someone is... They could have... They have some kind of illness, a strong anxiety Anxiety that could be also from not being balanced. They could go through healing and dealing. There could be a child here. They are, uh, yeah, the, they are, there is a child that they are arguing about. Um, yeah, there is a child they are arguing about. This could also be, they have a, yeah, they, they, this has been a long dispute in a family situation. Who's going to keep the child? How, how are they going to get along? How are they going <coughs> to... Blah, blah, blah. Like, how are they going to, how are they going to divide uh, the assets? How, you know, how are they going to look after someone? They could also have a child that has special needs where they need to, like, someone is using that against someone for, like, they, they're saying, you have to sacrifice that because this is our child. So there is a child here that someone is using as well. And they're saying, but they're saying, I don't want to still stay here and invest in the situation here. I'm not happy. Yeah, so someone isn't happy uh, and, and they try to, to fix it. They try to fix the situation. What are their feelings about collective? We have the Queen of Cups. So, okay, they, their feelings is that they want to offer you commitment. They are just going to go for it. They've been hiding their feelings. They had been they loved you since the first time they saw you, but they've been in a commitment and they have they have this uh, there is a complex situation around them. This person here is not very good with communication. It looks like this person will step up and will communicate, but this is someone that is not very good with communicating at all. This person have been hiding. They they have not gone about nothing in a good way um i'm also seeing here that um i'm getting okay i'm getting here the more uh, more uh, yeah morality so it is possible as well that someone that they work in a place where it's like very like the way uh, where they work and their role could be such as that this person seems that so rigid they have all their ducks in a row and so forth but it's saying here that someone isn't like that this person it's something about all this morality is just bogus. If if that culture is just a thin layer that can be destroyed by anyone. It's something about their awareness. They are coming to terms with their awareness that what's the point of having this facade when it's not, they are aware that inside this facade, things will, you know, when they the tower falls, there will be a lot of ice on the situation and there will be a lot of things that is coming to the surface. But what's the point of hiding everything when the happiness is sabotaged for everyone? Yeah, so this person, there is a person here that will change, change their ways, change their life, uh, change uh, situation. And the walls will come down. The walls will fall. They could have one child they take with them. Yeah, there is something about traveling towards you. It's happening very soon. There's a lot of chemistry. Yeah, there's a lot of chemistry. You are, you are attracting this person by enjoying your moments fully. There's something about religious factors as well here. Past life connection. Yeah, I'm getting that here. Expectation. You intuitively feel someone is going. This could also be a new love situation. There is despair. Again, someone, uh, someone's marriage have gone tits up. Someone has uh, 
there's a coffin, there is an ending, it's not gonna look good, there's poverty, something is coming up out, uh, out of the woodworks with this situation. Many people could judge this person because uh, they are not being seen as they could do something like that. This person is going to act outside of what is expected of them. This person would normally never be seen to do something like what they're going to do. Like uh, there will be like a lot of noise. So what about the tower? What about the tower here? What about the tower? Yeah, so we have here, this person is coming out of the cold. This person here lost some, lost strength. They were a coward, but now they are going to face it anyway. I feel this person is taking a child with them. Something very painful has happened to this person's family, mm, but things actually can change. It has to do with, um, it has to do with the morality, uh, you know, keeping a facade at all cost uh, and for what. So there's a strong passion between you and this person. Uh, I do see that, yeah, that's that's what it's about. Um, there's something around you as well, collective, where you feel like you are protected, but there could be some kind of stress around you as well. I feel that you are now going to see who is, who, people's intentions are coming to light. Yeah, if people's intentions are coming to light, for sure. Um, a soulmate connection here is going to be... Um, it's going to be out there. You might have a choice or following your heart, following... It's not a choice between two people, I feel, as such. It's like, okay, how, how am I going to go about this? But it will change a lot. There is a tower moment, but this tower moment is to do with like it's cha life changing. Yeah, this is the life changing tower moment collective. Wow, you could have earth elements in your chart. You could have it. You could uh, conceive a child, even if you think you can't have children. Yeah, confirming with the Ace of Wands. You could work with this person, or used to work, or used to do something in common, or you will will work with this person. Uh, like you could, there is a collaboration here. Um, there's a creative project as well. You and this person will very, very, very quickly establish a family. I'm get, definitely getting two earth signs coming together. Um, there, we also have Scorpio and, and Aquarius. And yeah, this is a twin flame connection. This is like a contract, a new beginning and a contract. It's like, boom, it's happening. Yes, say no more. It's um, it's going to shock so many people here. This person used to be a player, and uh, again, when they come towards you, uh, most will be like, "Oh, don't do that," or maybe you're just saying that as well. Someone here is coming in uh, very fast, but you think you think that this person is playing around when they come in. It looks like you will. Uh, you will still be with this person and you, I think you will be stressed because you'll be thinking, oh my gosh, what have I done? Right, this person's still in the third party because they could go away again and you'll be like, oh my God, what, why, why have I got myself into? I'm back, back to square one or I'm now back in this. In, in a saying here, like you, you this, it's, um, th th this, this situation here is meant to happen you are stronger here. It, it looks like if something happened between you and this person before where something, you know, you were left or there was a third party coming up and they stayed with a third party or you stayed with a third party and this was not a good ending. Uh, feelings like it's going to be told what actually happened. They're going to tell you what happened. What happened here is something about them hiding to do with children. There's something they're ashamed of or don't want to, something that they were told to be ashamed of. That's why they have to stay in this marriage. There is a reason. And there is this reason that this person have grown up. But yeah, with the devil here, there is this obsessive, Someone is attached to some status and that will come to the surface. This person here has to conquer something when it comes to being judged as well. They have, um, there is a very strong spiritual connection here. And at some point, yeah, there will be, 
a bit of a like, wow, can I deal with this? There will be like people saying, like there will be one of you feeling judged or feeling that this is just too much, too soon. This is like, maybe we're, maybe we are obsessed with each other. Maybe we are like the crazy ones and you know, it's like, is this a karmic connection? But this person could be from overseas. They have to go back to fix something and there could be a this period where you feel that, okay, well, what have I done? This person, and maybe you will accept a commitment from them as well. Like they're, they're leaving something behind with you and you are like, what have they left behind? It's, it, it will happen very fast um, and you will feel right about it, but you will still feel so wrong about it at the same time. You will feel, I just see that you will feel slightly slightly anxious, <laughs> but it, you, this person is coming back. I'm saying that they're like, okay, I told you I'm coming back. <clears throat> or maybe you don't even, when they're gone, you were like, don't come back, don't come back. Because it's a lie, it's a big change. You you will, there, it's like a big change in your life happening with this situation. This comes with the, uh, <clears throat> yeah, see? Revealing their feelings. All right, the emperor, this coming to light is happening very fast with the eight of wands. Honestly, it's happening very, very fast. And uh, there is someone behind them. Uh, there is someone with a broken heart behind them. There is a Scorpio potentially. They're going to tell you about her. They're going to tell you about the situation. They're, they're, this is like gloves off, information sharing. Okay. Yeah, they're going to be very brutally honest. Um, and... Um, there's going to be distance for a little while and there could be something as well for some of you where you will spend time with them and then when they're gone, there will be like this kind of <clears throat> whispering. It's like, oh my God, like there's like this. <laughs> I don't know why I'm hearing that. <laughs> it's like you made out with someone in the church or something. Uh, that's what I'm getting. Like, oh my God, you made out with a priest. How could you? Priest, I'm not supposed to kiss anyone. But yeah, well, priests can kiss people as well. Like you're not doing anything illegal, but it might be according to according to someone. I have a lot to say about it. Yeah, don't don't get anxious about it. This is destined. This is destined, but you will feel anxious about it. People will say stuff. For sure, let him. This will be like a, a union that will be spoken about for sure. Um, yeah, a lot of whispers about this union. It's like it would never stop. It will be in the news for the next ten years. Yeah, this this romance here. Once this is un, un you know, unleashed. Is going to be spoken about this emperor is coming to stay they are coming clean about their emotions for you but there is an ending around them that everybody will talk about and that's the death here there is a queen of wands in reverse it could be someone here that is sacrificed they're going to come in and make some chaos here but anyway there is this new beginning with an emperor and an empress a lot of shit is hidden it's coming to light a lot of like there is a lot of illusions around the situation. There was an ending between the two of you. For sure there was an ending. And there was no contact since this ending. I think I'm going to leave it at that. Um, collective, please like, subscribe and uh, yeah, leave a comment. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm sending you so much love. See you very soon. Take care.